4. Mature Ways to Deal with a Breakup Having a person who constantly gives you love and affection must be one of the best feelings in the world. Nevertheless, not everyone that you meet will be like that. Some of them will prove not worthy of your time and effort because something is missing in the relationship. Move away from a particular person when there is a rough spot in your relationship, or when your needs and emotions are not being fulfilled. Breaking up with someone is difficult to do. You gave someone your feelings and time. Now, you just need to get on with your own life, having to cope with the loneliness that starts after a breakup. Sometimes people cannot express how lonely they feel after a breakup because the relationship they had was intense. Everyone has had a breakup after which they were emotionally destroyed or didn't act in a mature way. Maybe you stalked their social media or called them a thousand times. Those are not ways a mature person should react when they break up with someone. Breakups require a difficult process of healing. Healing a broken heart, a heart that was once filled with love, affection, and positivity, is truly a hard mountain to climb. However, a broken heart can be healed. Self-esteem can be restored and you should feel stronger after the process of healing is finished. When you break up with someone, it is hard to accept the fact that you are left alone in this cruel world. Suddenly, there is no person whom you can hug and kiss anymore, and you feel the emptiness that is left behind. If you are an emotionally stable person who knows her feelings, coping with a breakup in a normal adult-like manner is a must. The ways that I'm going to give you can serve as a guide on how to deal with a breakup like the mature person that you are. Before we go to the video, for more similar content, like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Also, don't forget to hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any further videos. Number 1. You should acknowledge and own your feelings. The most important thing to do after a breakup is reflect and realize the swirl of emotions with which you have been hit after you and your partner have moved on. You will definitely feel sad, despite everything that he may have done, even if you were the one to break up with him, feeling sadness is normal so don't worry. For goodness sake, you spent so much time with him, so it's quite normal to feel sad not having him in your life anymore. You should acknowledge the pain of losing someone you love. The process of grief and sadness is a necessary step toward healing a broken heart. Suppressing those feelings is never a good thing to do, because they will continue to exist. Even if you find someone new, those feelings will emerge eventually in your new relationship. I know, I should have told you that you are a strong woman, that you shouldn't be sad. But let's face it, every strong woman you know has felt sad at some point in her life. The best way to let go of your emotions is to face them. Cry, scream, go to a boxing class, but just let those feelings of sadness and anger out, because otherwise they will haunt you. You will have emotional and physical problems if you don't acknowledge them and let them out of your system. Number two, you shouldn't neglect yourself, you should heal in a positive way. Focusing on yourself and on your well being is of vital importance when facing a difficult breakup. You should practice self care and self compassion since it will help you move on from him. That's what a mature person would do. Most people after a breakup indulge in some kind of unhealthy activity. Some use unhealthy food to suppress their emotions. Some go out drinking until they pass out. Others sleep for 14 hours a day, thinking that the emotions will pass. However, a mature person knows not to neglect themselves. The perfect time to start focusing on yourself is when you are facing a breakup. Those healthy practices that you were thinking of starting, now is the time to try them. After a breakup, you will feel depressed and helpless. Isolating yourself in your room, indulging in those unhealthy snacks, and watching romantic and sad movies is never a good way to heal a broken heart. Many people start their gym membership, which they told themselves months ago that they would start. They go to the gym, put on their headphones, listen to some powerful blasting music, and let go of their anger and negative emotions. Number 3. You should change your perception. You may feel sad, lonely, and scared that you are going to be alone. Let me tell you right away, there is nothing you should be scared of. Sometimes a woman or a man is afraid of breaking up with their partner, even if their relationship isn't working, because they are afraid they'll be alone and they will never find somebody else. Instead of breaking up, they idolize their partner and think like they are the only person in the world as who else would be in a relationship with them. The feeling that you will never find another partner is ridiculous, but real. There is a possibility that you will obsess over the feeling. 
even when you are ready to start dating again, maybe you feel afraid of wasting your time with someone who may or may not cherish your time together. Such a feeling is understandable, but it's important to work on your perception of that fear. Let's be clear, the time that you spend with a loved one is not a waste of time. You should remember that you chose him. The perception of fear is hard to change. Keep in mind that if that person was not the right one for you, you should be patient and wait. There is a man out there ready to love you with all his heart. Number four, you should connect with and focus on the other people in your life. You have broken up. Now you are alone and should focus on others. You should get out and meet new people. Call your friends and family members and surround yourself with the people who care about you. Those people will boost your confidence and self-esteem. You should lean on other people and engage in activities that you love. A mature person will know how to have fun in her life. She will find things that she loves and do more of them. Positive energy and being playful will attract positive people. You should intentionally bring people into your life who will bring you joy and happiness. A mature person should know how to deal with a breakup. A mature person will focus on herself and not let her emotions control her actions.